Welcome to the Windows Club. If your Microsoft Edge browser hangs, freezes, crashes or is simply not working, then either read through this article on the Windows Club or simply watch this video, I'll guide you to the resolutions. First of all, set your system such that the start page for browsers and tabs is about blank and I'll tell you why, because this makes the loading lighter. Otherwise, there could be a lot of reasons for it to hang or freeze. And this has been explained over a separate article and a video, but I'll show you how this is done. Click on these three dots at the top right corner and select settings. In the settings menu, go to start home and new tabs. And when it says when it starts, it would be at open tabs from the previous session, change it to open these pages. Next to pages, click on add a new page and copy the URL about blank. Select add and this has been set. The next solution is to delete edge browser cookies cache etc. Now this is easy. Click on these three dots once again. Select history. Click on these three dots in the sub menu. Select clear browsing history and then check all the boxes here and click on clear now. The next solution is to disable or remove an incompatible extension. Click on these three dots once again and simply go to extensions. Here you'll find all the extensions that are active and you can disable using this switch any extension that is not in use or is suspicious. After this you can refresh modify edge wire settings. This is done as follows. First of all we will right click on the start button select settings. Then we will go to apps on the list on the left hand side. We will select apps and features and then we will scroll down in this list to Microsoft Edge. We will click on these three dots at the right corner and select modify. It will need administrator permissions and then you can click on the option to repair it. The next solution would be to reset Edge via the browser. For this click on these three dots here select settings in the right menu scroll down to reset settings and click on this option which says restore settings to their default values and then click on reset after this comes the last solution which is disable hardware acceleration for this click on these three dots at the top right corner once again select settings in the settings window on the list on the left hand side scroll down to system You'll find this option which says use hardware acceleration when available. Turn the switch associated with this one off and you would have to restart the browser after this. Isn't this easy and interesting? If you have any doubts, please go to the original article on the Windows Club. Scroll down to the comment section and write your query. We will surely answer to it. Do not forget to subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching this video and have a nice day.